Hello friends, I am Dr. Radhika Goel, Assistant Professor in Biani Group of Colleges. Welcome you all, I am here on the behalf of GuruGPU.com. Today's my topic is area between two Cartesian curves. How we can find out area between two Cartesian curves? Let us suppose there are two curves. First one is y1 is equals to f1x and second one is y2 is equals to f2x. Then we want to find out a common area between those two curves. Geometrically these two curves like this, this is y1 and this is y2. Then common area between these two curves is this shaded area. So common area is area A, B, C, D, E, F minus of A, B, C, D, G, H. Because when you subtract this area and this area, then you can find out this area. We know that area A, B, C, D, E, F is area between this curve and x axis and we know that this is given by a to b where a is this point a and b is this point b so its value is a to b limit of x y1 dx and a to b y2 dx y2 is this lower curve that means this is a to b y1 minus y2 dx we can explain this by this example in this example, we want to find out area between these two curves, which is y square is equals to ax, which is equation of a parabola. And this one is x square plus y square is equals to 4ax, this is equation of a curve. When we trace these two curves, then you can see that this is equation of the parabola, y square is equals to ax, and this is equation of a circle whose center is 2a0 and radius is 2a. Now we want to find out common area, then you can see that this shaded area is this common area. Required area is, now you can see here that common area is O, A, B, C, O. But we cannot find it uh, commonly because you can see here that O, A, C, O is with the parabola y square is equals to a and portion C, A, B, C. This is with the circle equation. So, required area is two times. Why this two times? Because there is symmetry with respect to x axis. So, we want to find out this whole area. So, we multiply this by two because this is symmetry about x axis and this is area about the x axis, right? So, this is for this area O A C O. You can see that O A, the limit is 0 to 3 A because this is 0, this is 3 A. The intersection point of these two curves is 3a. So, limit is from 0 to 3a. This is equation of the parabola because this common area is starting from this curve plus remaining portion is this and here x limits are from 3a to 4a to so 3a to 4a and here curve is of circle this and from this you can find out value of y which is under root of 4ax minus x square dx and when we solve this you can find out your result. Thank you, thank you, thank you. For further details, please log on to www.gurukepu.com.